The Blue Nose Pitbull is the American Pitbull Terrier, just blue. In recent years, the Pitbull Terrier has gained a bad reputation, as they became popular for being used in dogfighting. They are affectionate and loyal to those they know the most. They love to play and make the best family dogs. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. Exclamation mark. What is a blue nose pit bull? The Blue Nose Pitbull is either, an American Pitbull Terrier or American Staffordshire Terrier, or a mix of both. They have specific genes to make their coat a blue-like color. They are a rare dog because the coloring is caused by recessive genes. Their lifespan is between 12 to 15 years, however, exercise, diet, activity levels and genes can play a large role in the aging process of dogs. Blue Nose Pitbull appearance The Blue Nose Pitbull looks just like an American Pitbull Terrier, but blue in color. Pitbulls have a broad face and a short muzzle. With blue specifically having small blue eyes and a light gray nose. They have a stocky and athletic body, with defined muscles. Height and weight weight can vary depending on the puppy's parents' size and genes. As with most mammals, females will tend to be smaller than males. A fully grown blue nose weighs between 30 to 60 pounds and is between 18 to 21 inches tall. Colors The Blue Nose Pitbull isn't really blue, just a light gray. Their coat is typically a solid color, and sometimes it can be brindle stripe, which is when it appears to be tiger striped. Sometimes they will have face markings, white markings in between the eyes and down to the nose. They can also have white markings on their chest, and their feet, making it look like they are wearing little shoes. Coat the Pitbull has a very short and stiff, glossy coat. They will only require occasional brushing, and do not shed all year round. They will shed a little twice a year though. Blue Nose Pitbull Personality and Temperament Even though this breed is affectionate towards people, they are not great with other dogs. As this study found, American Pitbulls were aggressive to unfamiliar dogs, but not people. They are very energetic, and playful. Like most active and intelligent breeds, they can become easily frustrated with boredom and will chew everything in sight. How to Train Blue Nose Pitbull This is a smart breed, but, one which can be stubborn at times. Be patient when training them. Provide them with consistent and short training exercises, and over time you will have a well-trained dog. The best method of training is by positive reinforcement, this has been proven to be the most effective. Punishment can cause unwanted and problematic behaviors and health issues in your dog. Give your dog a reward when they follow your command. You can give them a treat, praise or more play. Start training your blue nose puppy the moment you bring them home. This breed needs a lot of mental stimulation, this prevents boredom and destructive behaviors. To make training more fun, you should play with your dog after training them. This has been proven to improve your dog's memory and relive stress. Exercise Requirements This dog is a very energetic and playful breed, they need regular exercise to prevent boredom and obesity. They should have at least a 90 minutes worth of exercise each day. This can include walks, jogging, and regular play. When walking your pit bull, it is advisable to keep them on a leash and avoid dog parks. As the pit bull is known for its unpredictable behavior around unfamiliar dogs, the Blue Nose Pitbull was bred for hunting, which means they are very athletic. Agility sports would be very beneficial for this breed as this can give them the exercise and mental stimulation they need. Grooming and Shedding Grooming the Blue Nose Pitbull is fairly easy and straightforward. They are not a high-maintenance dog. They have a short and stiff coat that only needs brushing and bathing occasionally. You should brush your dog's teeth regularly, or give them a dental stick alternative, to keep on top of oral hygiene. Make sure you clip your dog's nails regularly to avoid overgrowth and splitting. Check your dog's ears for wax buildup and debris to avoid infections. Finally, make regular grooming a positive experience for your dog, as this is part of your dog's regular routine and this will help to build a strong bond with your dog. Feeding a Blue Nose Pitbull 
For a dog to have a healthy life, they need to eat a balanced diet. Dogs need protein, as this can be converted into glucose for energy. In fact, it's better for dogs to eat meals with high protein content. A smaller pit bull should be fed around 1.5 cups of kibble a day divided into two equal meals and 2.5 cups for larger pit bulls. Meals should be once in the morning and once in the evening. Health Problems Blue Nose Pit Bull The blue nose pit bull's color has been achieved by years of inbreeding, meaning the gene pool has little variety. This means that they can be more likely to develop certain health issues. Hip dysplasia, malformation in the hip joints causing pain and arthritis. Skin allergies, commonly triggered by fleas and environmental factors. Hypothyroidism, causes abnormal weight gain and obesity if you're like most dog parents, or parents-to-be, you care for your pet immensely. Having pet insurance could save you from potential headaches of going to the vets with reimbursement for every vet bill from now on. Save massively on your pet's medical costs whether it's an illness, injury, or wellness expense that needs taking care of. A careful breeder will also ask you questions and will want to make sure you are suitable for one of their puppies. They should also provide health certificates for the dam and will tell you if the puppy's vaccinations are up to date. As in breeding can be a problem in this breed, it is best to find a breeder that will use genetic screening to their advantage. This can reduce the prevalence of hip dysplasia in dog populations. A puppy should be at least 8 weeks old to leave mom. Pit bulls are smart dogs that have the ability to change their behavior. With enough love and the right amount of care, you could bring up an adopted pit bull to be a happy and healthy member of your pack. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.